Okay, we gather here now to celebrate Holy Communion. That was a, a pretty savouring message. At the same time, it was a very uplifting message, wasn't it? Mm. But God, but God. And now we're going to celebrate how the Lord Jesus brought our freedom with his own body and blood. He gave himself for our sins. He placed his very life on the line for us and offered himself as a once and for all time perfect sacrifice for our sins. While we all wait for his return, we have the opportunity to honour his request, that we remember his sacrifices on the cross. Jesus asked us to do this, didn't he? He said, do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. So this is what we're doing here this morning. We're remembering and honouring Jesus' wishes that we celebrate Holy Communion together as a church family. Let us remember that the Lord Jesus Christ on the same night that he betrayed took the bread and when he had given thanks he broke it and he gave it to his disciples saying take eat this is my body which is given for you do this in remembrance of me. Likewise after the supper he took the cup and when he had given thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink you all of this, for this is my blood of the New Testament, which is shed for you and for many, for the remission of sins. Do this as often as you drink it, in remembrance of me. Do this in remembrance. Okay, would you like to come down and collect the bread and the cups? Thanks. Let's take the bread and let's do what he, Jesus asked us to do. Let's remember this bread represents the body of Christ, the bread of life himself. Let's eat together. Lord, as we together, this powerful symbol of your body which you offered up to be broken, whipped, beaten and tortured, pierced. Lord, that was for our healing. And Lord, as we partake of this sacrament by faith, Lord, we believe that we receive your healing into our bodies just as we took that symbol of the breath of your body into our bodies. Thank you, Jesus. Let's now take the cup. Come and see you. Let's now take the cup. Thank you, Jesus. Peace. This cup represents the blood of Christ, the cup of salvation, amen. This cup represents the blood that he shed 
and the blood that was shed was the, for the forgiveness of our sins. Let's shrink together. <coughs> Lord, we're just so grateful that even as we've read today, we were dead in our sins. But God. Amen. <coughs> Excuse me. But you intervened by grace. <coughs> Excuse me. You intervened by grace into our lives. And Lord, you brought salvation, and we're just so grateful. Loving Heavenly Father, at this table you graciously feed us with the bread of life and the cup of eternal salvation. May we who have reached out our hands to receive this sacrament be strengthened in your service. We who have sung your praises tell of your glory and truth in our lives. We who have seen the greatness of your love and see you face to face in your kingdom. And we come to worship you with all our brothers and sisters in Christ down through the ages, forever and ever. Father, we offer ourselves to you as a living sacrifice through Jesus Christ our Lord. Send us out in the power of your Spirit to live and work for your place and your praise and glory. Amen.